somebody's been working out. Negative. Well, then how'd you get so big? All of you. You're the hugest rats I've ever seen. Ain't you heard? The Sapiens used to test their nukes underground here with no regard for the subterranean dwellers. Now look! Ferocious fighters, those Sapiens. The best, or the very worst, depending on how you look at it. I think it was Lord Lewis Mountbatten that said, if the Third World War is fought with nuclear weapons, the Fourth will be fought with bows and arrows. The tremor you felt was caused by our king aerobicizing, which reminds me, I'm hungry. Up there lives the king, great guy! I entirely disagree. The rat's an imbecile. Self-serving, pompous, always working out, making the whole earth shake. I find it very annoying. Why do you keep wiping that bar? It must be clean by now. Come on, cheese for brains. Solve a riddle, win a sandwich. It's not as hard as it looks. I'd like to play. You? Okay, I got a good one for you. What saves human lives but is not man's friend? Been around for all time and will thrive till the end. It makes farmers cry, yet this pest cannot fly. A gorgeous coat I must concur, though never killed for its fur. Rats, well, we're survivors. It's hard to drown us, cause we're excellent sea divers. We can chew through pipes, survive a nuclear blast. Scale walls and fall and not get hurt at all. We've, We've done, done it in the past. Rats. Yes, we're resilient. Despite attempts to wipe us out, we grow by millions. And although we only live one short year long, a productive rat and wife could host a family 15,000 strong. Us furry vitamins here to stay. Oh, fooey! Rats, yes, rats. You know you're gonna need us anyway. Just think of all the breakthroughs science made at our expense. You can't deny, no matter how hard you try, our contributions have been immense. Rats, we're highly adaptable. So what if we've got a few diseases that are contractable? And as for crops we devastate, we've got to eat! Tell me, what would you choose for an entree? Boys and pellets, or rice, fruits, nuts, and sweets! Did you know that one year in Hawaii, some of our brothers ate about 11 million dollars worth of sugar cane? Yeah. Talk about a sweet tooth! You've heard of rats! Nocturnal creatures That means we're up all night inspecting kitchen features Wherever man goes, the rat too surely can There must be some way we could live to enjoy The same long lifespan Oh, rats! Oh, shucks! Us furry vitamins here to stay Oh, fooey! Rats, yes, rats! You know you're gonna need us in any way. Rats! Oh, rats! Us freaky vermin wanna play. Rats! You bet your sweet patootie, rats! You know you're gonna need us anyway. Rats! Here's one thing I bet you didn't know about rats. We make a sensational rat waste sandwich. Don't sniff for food, we're arm sniffing for food. You hear me?
Give me ten more and we'll call it a day. Ten more what? Squat thrusts! <laughs> I just finished my workout a little while ago. You might have felt it up at the surface. And I think we did. It felt like an earthquake. Yes, well, I work out very hard. No doubt. Is there any way you could cause an even bigger earthquake? I'm asking for a reason. See, I... There's only one way, and it would never happen, not in a jillion years. I've been trying to get my fellas on the health kick for ten months now, and it's no use. They don't realize they're killing themselves out there. Have you ever seen such a revolting display of hedonism? The rat only lives for one year, you know. Well, Mother Nature is a complex gentlewoman. There must be some reason. Sure there's a reason. We got joked! I have in my mind's library an old Indian proverb that may be of some small comfort. It is better to sit down than to stand. It is better to lie down than to sit. But death is best of all. I relate more to the severely troubled Woody Allen who said, I don't want to achieve immortality through my work, I want to achieve it through not dying. Point taken. So, you think the whole working out thing is going to prolong your life expectancy? I know it will! You help me get the rats active and healthy, and you'll get your earthquake, I guarantee it! a projector. This is very good. Very good. Thanks for the quake, King. This is very good. Let's keep rocking and you don't stop. I love the way we do the hip hop. And one, and two, and one, two, three, four. How am I gonna get him out of here? Him there. It's so darn dark, I can't see anything. I'm not moving. Looks like a page from my book of knowledge. Shh! I didn't say anything. I'm trying to reach something very small lodged in this cave's wall. What is it? I don't know. Then why do you want it? Because I want to be an archaeologist someday. This could be my first great find. What makes you think so? 
It was just east of here that the Dead Sea Scrolls were found, in Jordan. Oh, darn, I can't reach. Maybe these will help. Thanks! Those tools are all fine, but I'd prefer Eli's pustule popper. Hey, Eli, you'll hurt your eyes out there. Try wearing these. Ah, you are a menace to the sea, but now you do right by me. Thank you for the sunglasses. It's the least you can do. What is it? I don't know! Ah! Eli's Pustule Popper. <laughs> 